So here we go, riding around, and basically, as you will be, oh goodness sakes, stupid cat guy, and as you will probably be happy to see, we're back with Shisha. So anyway, let's get to this destination. Um, I'm going. We are bonded now. You and I joined through the powers of the void. That's splendid. Um, yes, I sort of left the Thieves Guild uh, missions, um, sort of half done. Um, what's he spotted? Well, okay, we've got some frosty things. Ow. Right, let's see if we can actually get there now without further interruption. Oh, it looks like we've got a frost troll. Oh, for goodness sakes. Oops! For goodness sakes. Oh, for goodness sakes, why does the assassin have to get in the way? <laughs> Sorry about the arrows in the back, assassin. Where's my horse? Oh. I'm sure you can. You know what, I think that guy's going to get very annoying. Right. So, where were we? With any luck, we can actually get to where we're going without interruptions. But, there seem to be an awful lot of... Here we go, this looks promising. Here we go. All hail the saviour of the dark brotherhood. Finally here. Of course. I've scouted the ruins and I'm certain Carlia is still inside. Okay, cool. Um, did you actually see her though? No, I found her horse. Don't worry, I'm taking care of it. She won't be using it to escape. Let's get moving. I want to catch her inside while she's distracted. Take the lead. Cool. Let's go. Just make certain you keep your eyes open. Carlia is as sharp as a blade. The last thing I need is you blundering into a trap and warning her that we're here. Oh, for goodness sakes. Let's... I mean... Yeah, let's just... That's enough of this unnecessary chatting. We need to keep going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure we do. Um... Okay, well... It certainly looks like a standard... sort of... situation. Have you heard the tale of Matthew Bellamont and the great treachery of Jaden Hall? Kill a boy's mother and vengeance festers in the sun. Is he gonna open this door or not? Come on. Come on. Here we go. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, go on. Open the door. They say that these ancient Nordic burial mounds are sometimes impenetrable. This one doesn't look too difficult. Well, I can't open it. Quite simple, really. I don't know what the fuss is about these locks. All it takes is a bit of know-how. Not a lot of skill. That should do it. After you. The Dread Father. Yes, yes, what is it now? Don't get funny with me, boy. So, traps, huh? Well, I'm not exactly the most careful person, but I'll try. Stench in here. This place smells of death. Be on your guard. That's probably because it's full of undead. Most of the times, the place is stink of death. I mean, you did only moments ago say it was a burial mound. It's normally a good clue as to the 
stinking of death, but uh, Oh, <laughs> that was the trap, releasing a load of stupid zombies and ugh, ugly creatures, fetid vermin. I assume that just closes it. Well, you never know, it might have opened the other one, because there is another side. Ah, it's jammed. Pull the chain over there and watch out for the spikes. Oh, it's thirsty. Like Carlia reset all of the Very tracks. thirsty. Well, that looks like that's jammed, but why do I not trust it? <laughs> yeah. Never trust anything. Who's there? Your feeble attempt to hide is insulting. That was a bit feeble. <laughs> Sword, yeah, might as well. <laughs> Guy is taking a serious punishment. He's a good pincushion. See if we can actually go a little bit further without too much more amusement. <laughs> Ebony arrows, iron arrows. I suppose really I should select the the better arrows. Better to use than l use them while they're there. Two more of them ahead. You're not very perceptive, are you, boy? Huh? Ah, same trap, basically. Oh, 
God, don't let this be too far in. Let's have a look. Unrelenting force is always fun. Like this, that you mean, like blundering into them like that, like, like that, like that, that, yeah. I think we've disturbed plenty of. <laughs> it's nailed to the port colours. Oh dear me. Let's have a look. Well, these tombs are certainly. Deep. Well. That's ah, just a death lord. He is. Quite a warrior. <laughs> Did it look round and then got an arrow in the eye? Go on, kill that. Don't come up this way. Kill that. Who's that? Is he blind? Whoa, I am blooming that guy at the ceiling. <laughs> right, okay, come on. Get back up. Get up, Mercer. Get up. What on earth? What is that? It's just a regular skeever. I know how many arrows. Any bow might as well, I suppose. It's all gonna be worth something, right? So I'm on iron arrows again, am I? Let's just slap dwarven arrows in there now. And I've got the ebony arrows, but I might as well just build them up. Iron arrows, ebony arrows. Always worth collecting the arrows. I don't think I've got that skill yet, you know, the one that doubles the amount of arrows you can recover. I'm not sure whether it's particularly worth having, but if you're wandering around like I am, using your bow as your primary, I suppose it might be worth an investment, I suppose. This is where I'm guessing is the only way to go. Keep forgetting I've got that stealthy rolls. Hmm. Well, that's unsafe. Burn, Mercer. <laughs> Well, I'd, I'd get out of there if I were you. Right. Oh, have we just circled round? Oh, so actually it's... It's 
I don't, I'm not sure how I rolled up the stairs. I'm just that good. It is completely different style of play, the whole sneaking thing. It is, it's surprisingly, it, it's a good distraction, it's almost like it's another game. Very good. Skull and salt. Why? Why would someone put a random skull next to some salt? At least he's capable of catching up suddenly. Now that just looks like it's gonna get up. Your blood will adorn my blade. Making this too easy. <laughs> I like the sword he's got, it makes things glow pretty. It's dead, its end has already come. That's it, it's it's already at its end. Ebony Warhammer, Amethyst Bone Mill, yeah that'll do. Amulet of Kynareth, well it's got a good ratio, might as well, might as well grab it. What I want to know is how did she, I mean I probably could sneak past all these but it's certainly not going to have been easy. This shouldn't take long. trying to shout him into small pieces and they might succeed oops I might have caught him just just a little no oh. Well, I'm glad you did, because standing there while I fight them would be a little bit rude. Uh, da -da -da -da, okay. <laughs> I love the physics in this game. Oh, no, that's probably not. Yeah, you come through and step on that pressure plate. How do you even know that? Are you some sort of master tracker or something? You've just written your own <laughs> I love his flip then. That was very skilled. So close. Ooh. Bernie person. Okay, this looks important. Up ahead. Looks perfect for hiding an ambush. Be ready. 
Be ready. That didn't sound good. Oh, hello. What was that? It was me shooting an arrow at the undead, you idiot. You can't hide from me. Oh dear, this is not good. I can't believe it's a bloody dragon priest. I should fight the dragon priest, you stupid blind man. There, behind you! Well, I'm glad he's fighting it in hand to hand and not me. Yeah, no mask. But then again, well, I don't know anything about the masks. No, no, I know nothing about masks. I'm just an assassin. That's it. Just an assassin. I don't go around hunting masks or anything like that. Nope. That's. I must be thinking of someone else. Oh, I can hear a word wall. That's for certain. Spell tomes are quite valuable. Magical stuff. Come on then, give me your knowledge. Weapon disarm. Hmm. Looks like that's a important Oh Grand Soldier. Well have you got a claw? I, I haven't got a claw. Um uh oh. I'm guessing this is a bit where he gets us in. Because I ain't got a claw. Ah, it's one of the infamous Nordic puzzle doors. How quaint. <laughs> Without the matching claw, they're normally impossible to open. Since I'm certain Carlyle already did away with it, we're on our own. Go on then. Fortunately, these doors have a weakness. Exploit it. Quite simple, really. Carly is close, I'm certain. What? How the hell did you What? What how the... what yeah, what what what? You didn't do it, you I'm confused. My head hurts. I'm just gonna What the hell? Uh oh. Oh that's not good. Kidding me. Do you honestly think your arrow will reach me before my blade finds your heart? Give me a reason to try. You're a clever girl, Carlia. I've been my paralyzed. The estate and funny yeah. hunting room meadery was inspired. To ensure an enemy's defeat, you must first undermine his allies. It was the first lesson Gallus taught us. You always were a quick study. Not quick enough. Otherwise, Gallus would still be alive. Gallus had his wealth, and he had you. All he had to do was look the other way. Did you forget the oath we took as Nightingales? Did you expect him to simply ignore your methods? Enough of this mindless banter. I... Come, Carlia. It's time for you and Gallus to become reunited. I'm confused. Well, she's drank some... Why is she drinking? I'm no fool, Mercer. Crossing blades with you would be a death sentence. But I can promise the next time we meet, it will be your undoing. 
cool. She's good at brewing potions. How interesting. It appears Gallus's history has repeated itself. Carlia has provided me the means to be rid of you, and this ancient tomb becomes your final resting place. This is unfortunate. You know what intrigues me the most? The fact that this was all possible because of you. Farewell. I'll be certain to give Brynjolf your regard. This is not the way that I exit. Please let it not be the way I exit. was unnecessary. <laughs>